Good morning, friends. We are continuing to represent numbers with place value disks. So here are my place value disks here. And as a reminder, I have my thousands place value disks. This is kind of wiggly. My hundreds place value disk. My tens place value disk and my ones place value disk. The color doesn't really matter, but what's on the disk and which place it goes does matter. So I have the number 206 here, and I want to show it in hundreds, tens, and ones. So if I'm showing the number 206, I want to have two hundreds, zero tens, and six ones. Two, and I'm going to make them really neat. Three, four, five, six. Oops, move my face here so you guys can see it. Perfect. So then on my paper, I would write two hundreds, zero tens, and six ones. And then on my place value chart here, I would draw two hundreds, just like this, zero tens, and six ones. You can draw it just like I did, like little dots, or you can draw it with a circle and a one in the middle. And then this one for the hundreds would be a circle and the hundred in the middle. Now I want to do 206 using only tens and ones. So I'm going to go back to my place value chart. Now I can't use any hundreds for this next challenge. I have to use only tens and ones. So I'm going to get out as many tens as I can. I know that 100 is the same as 10 tens. So it's really easy for me to switch out 100 for 10 tens. Count with me. One group of 10, two groups of 10, three groups of 10, four groups of 10, five groups of 10, six groups of 10, seven groups of 10, eight groups of 10, nine groups of 10, 10 groups of 10. Now I'm going to switch out my other 100. Count with me again. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, oh, it's going off the page here, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. So I should now have 200 in tens. So I should have 20 tens because I had 200 and 100 is the same as 10 tens. So 200 is the same as 20 tens. Let's just double check to make sure. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. This is 100. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Perfect. Now I can draw it on my paper. And this is the same thing you guys are going to be doing today on your screens. So it says only tens and ones. So I've got my hundreds, tens, and ones. And I'm going to draw 20 tens. Count with me. 1 10, 2 tens, 3 tens, 4 tens, 5 tens, 6 tens, 7 tens, 8 tens, 9 tens, 10 tens, 11 tens, 12 tens, 13 tens, 14 tens, 15 tens, 16 tens, 17 tens, 18 tens, 19 tens, 20 tens, which is the same as 200. And then six months. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Now, when it says how many tens I have, I can count that and say I have 20 tens and six ones. You're going to do the same thing today on your Nearpod, and I'm going to be checking. So when it gives you a challenge to see how many tens there are instead of hundreds or vice versa, I want you to think in your brain about how many tens are in a hundred and do your best. Have fun!